sometimes, at least from my standpoint. And then just his air dodge is also pretty tricky to uh, circumvent as well. So that plus, uh, but the disjoints though, it's gonna, the the fact that they have a double character disjoint will prove to be quite a challenge for the red team because they have to both get in close, fairly close for Ness, and uh, obviously close from uh, Dr. Mario. But they are finding the combos fairly, uh, fairly early on and fairly well here as uh, Thunderstorm already tacks on 67, 76 damage now. And uh, they are just keeping the pressure on, focusing blue team on this side of the stage and this side of the stage only. They are having a hard time getting back as they finally let Thunderstorm come back on. But with 105, he is just one back throw from Ness away. Great combo again from uh, uh, the red team. Chaos in Tokyo just being fearless right now. And he gets the back air on uh, Wawa Peach. And that is the first stock take. And uh, another up air from Tokyo will claim 1-2 on the blue team. Even though they have the disjoint, it is uh, it is looking to be very, very uh, dire for the blue team here early on. Usually when you have these uh, up-close characters, you're thinking, okay, well, they have to respect uh, the blue team's boundaries. They have to throw out the attacks that have the longest hurt box from... Uh, the longest hitbox from their own hurt box, and, you know, they have to play very patiently, but Chaos and Tokyo are just going... <laughs> trying to get the flush from Chaos there. I'm not sure if Dr. Mario can get the flush. But, uh, yeah, Chaos and Tokyo just not playing the standard game that you would expect here, and it is actually paying off for them right now. Great tipper forward smash connection. Uh, finally takes out one on Chaos. And uh, Chaos actually interrupting the edge guarding from uh, the blue team, and Tokyo will find a safe purchase back on stage. And uh, blue team trying to respond on their own right now, doing a little more, uh, fairly better job playing the aerial game, even though, yeah... You stick on the ground, and another up smash from uh, Chaos will be able to send out uh, another stock on, what was that, Robin? But another stock take on Ness. It, that was his first stock? Yeah, he did hang on. It was only Dr. Mario. Yeah, that's my fault. Uh, look, but Thunderstorm coming in, and I think he'll be too far. No, he did use the, uh, and he does beat out the uh, Elwin. Very nice job uh, of Chaos throwing out the uh, up B at the right time, beating out both uh, hits of the Elwin. But an up smash will be able to send out Wawa Peach as well, and he gets the throw combo. But Thunderstorm responding with a back air across the stage. Stock claim on red. And oh, just able to fish through all of that commotion going on on that, uh, that left side of the stage from the red team. Thunderstorm, very nice recovery on that. Tries to get a pivot grab, but Chaos sends him out, and now they're trying to focus Wawa Peach, who has the lower point in the damage here, so they're just making it fairly easier on themselves. Uh, even though they do have uh, s stock advantage, uh, Tokyo, he's not seeming the role of uh, stock tank. Yeah, he is going a lot more... Uh, he's going in deep more than you expect a so uh, stock tank to do. And he gets the second up B. Very nice recovery from Wawa, just sticking through it. And avoiding the... Uh, uh, that'll be a 1-1 on uh, both red and uh, blue, but the red team did have the uh, advantage of the stock. And he gets the footstool beat out. Ah. You don't want to see it end like that, but you know, it's the first uh, first round. It was a little bit of an uphill battle, but uh, yeah, Footstool is just a, an accidental disgrace move there. So we'll see. Uh, no swaps. All right, so it's just definite gameplay shift here. Um, oh, well, they are considering. Okay, we have... Okay, all right. The Fire Emblem team coming out in... Or the clone team, if you think they're clones. And the swap of colors. Let's see if the swap of colors to green does it. <laughs> but anyways, um, let's see. Why would they swap off from... I mean, Thunderstorm did a very good job as Robin. I'm very interested to what he can see with... Uh, what he can do with Marth then. If he thinks that's the, uh, the better pick right now. I mean, if they noticed that uh, the red team just wasn't having any of it, not playing defensive. Um, having just the just the, the prowess that Marth has with his disjoint. He's one of the best disjoint characters out there, if not the best. So we'll see what Thunderstorm can do with him. Uh, but again, uh, green team suffering a little bit as red team has taken a fairly uh, impressive lead so far. Mind games from Chaos just throwing out short hops. Just trying to trick the green team and throwing out a move they don't mean. That's the one of the only ways that they're going to be able to get in on the green team. Even though they did it most of the time the last round. Um, 
the way to the beat disjoints, you really have to play a lot of mind games and make them throw out a move. Uh, if they have enough uh, end lag uh, after the move, that's your chance to move in. And that's one of the only ways that, like, characters that, like, uh, the Mario Brothers and all that can move in on disjoint characters. Back throw from Tokyo will be able to take out, and uh, that'll be a two-stock take on green team already in the... Uh, <clears throat> at the uh, the first minute here. Great job from Tokyo, just uh, using that up the when he was on that ledge so he can get the grab and uh, get the hit on Marth so he can stop the edge guarding as well. Accidental hit from uh, Tokyo, sending Chaos out to the left side. Uh, but Thunderstorm not finding any chance to uh, get a stage spike. I mean, red team does that. There it is, finally. Get a stock claim cross stage so we'll see if they can keep this uh momentum going oh wow what the hell happened there uh because i saw he got the bounce on so that meant he did i'm not sure if he got this but uh he possibly got a jump out of it probably it, it was probably a tech and he used like the jump right afterward or something i don't know it just looked really wonky back throw not gonna do it just missed time that forward smash so chaos came in with the up smash and gave uh, both him and his teammate uh, ability to get back on stage. Wow, Mario going in deep with the roll back there, but uh, he didn't find anything off of it uh, either. Chaos just throwing out those back short off back airs, trying to keep the green team pressured. And uh, I mean, even though they do have uh, very high percentages, green team is finding a little bit of a stride, even though they had a stock tank. They were keeping red team pressured, and uh, red team was tr having a little bit of difficulty moving in. And uh, back air, I believe from uh, Wawa, no that wasn't Wawa, from uh, Thunderstorm will be able to claim stock on, and Thunderstorm still trying to go in, yeah, I mean, you definitely want to go in there when you have a 3-4, and uh, Mario has that high percentage, get him with the up, uh, yeah, actually, I'm not sure how fast Dr. Mario's fall would go, because uh, his up B, if he would have fell and Marth would have gone back with an up B when Dr. Mario wasn't there, because the up B uh, saved him there, as another stock take on, uh, uh, Wawa Peach happened on the other side. And another great tech, I think a footstool happened as well. Back throw, and uh, Thunderstorm not finding any purchase with the uh, the tipper forward smash connection as well. But a back air will force out Tokyo. Chaos still just snaking through and able to claim some sort of stage advantage for his, uh, his team here. But great back air from Wawa, able to take on Chaos finally. And uh, DK Thunder... Yeah, uh, Thunderstorm didn't want to risk getting down there too late because of uh, Mart's fall speed. There he goes. Yes, you just uh, just like we said before, all you have to do with Ness is just uh, eat that little trail of the thunder, and he's going down. The only way he was getting back, I think, was from either positioning it correctly or getting a, a wall bounce, too. So, yeah, that was very difficult for Tokyo to come back from. And uh, I believe that was a uh, very... Very short hop up air from Tokyo, able to claim on it, and yeah, Wawa not just finding the right angle with that up B, and Tokyo and Chaos will advance on to winners finals. Whoo boy! <sighs> Excuse me a second, I need a bit of a drink here. Ah, uh, okay. So. Let's see what we got here in losers, if that is what we're going to. Oh, we're getting singles started, so we might see a singles match on stream, or we might just have that going off off stream a little bit. But, uh, yeah, we'll definitely keep it rolling for you guys as soon as we can. Thank you guys very much for your viewership. Um, there's just a big crowd out there. Watching either what's going on here or at G4, po probably G4, because they had that up on the, the main TV, and then the secondary TV is the one they have with the uh, the stream match. Oh yeah, they mentioned best of five, we don't have anything like that uh, yet, so that'll definitely be G4. Oh yeah, um, I forgot to mention that, we have, uh, we have uh, three TV setups, so um, anytime a, uh, a bigger tournament is uh, happening, um, you can watch, uh, the tournament 